find it hard to express what it means to me to join all of you here in this sacred place and in this special and holy season of Advent to recognize the role that so many of you play as instruments of peace in God's world. In recent years, I have had the great privilege of meeting so many Christians who, with such inspiring faith and courage, are battling oppression and persecution, or who have fled to escape it. Forgiveness, as many of you know far better than I, is not a passive act or submission. Rather, it is an act of supreme courage, of a refusal to be defined by the sin against you. Throughout history, in these lands which are the cradle of faith for Jews, Muslims, and Christians, communities of different beliefs have shown that it is possible to live side by side as neighbors and friends. Coexistence and understanding are not just possible, therefore. They are confirmed by hundreds of years of shared experience. Extremism and division are by no means inevitable. All three of the great Abrahamic faiths believe in a loving, just, and merciful God who cares for creation, who cares for his creatures, and who expects us to care for one another. I declare before you all that my whole life, whether it be long or short, shall be devoted to your service and to the service of our great imperial family to which we all belong.